It's got fruit in it. It's delicious. It's a little. It's on the healthier side because Halloween is so full of candy and sweets that we wanted to do a video where there was something a little more healthy. So if you look at a candy corn, you will see that there is yellow on the bottom, orange in the middle, and then a white tip. So we are going to take our fruit and make it look like this. So first things first, guys. You are going to take some of your pineapple and fill up the bottom of the glass, just like this. Such a simple thing to do, very easy, very simple, and a little healthier. So there is your first layer with the pineapple. You can use as much or as little of the pineapple as you want. So I'm gonna spin the plate around because now we're going to need to put in our mandarin oranges, and this creates the orange level, obviously. All right, guys, so, so far so good. We have our yellow layer and our orange layer. Now, the orange layer is a little bigger because if you look at a piece of candy corn, the orange is the biggest layer. Now, we're going to take our Ready Whip right here, and we are going to put the white on the top. You can add as much or as little as you'd like. Just like that, sitting on the top. All right, guys, so there you have it, your yellow, orange, and white candy corn fruit tree. Then you can stick a couple of actual candy corns in the top or sprinkle them all over the top just for added decoration. Lammy, what do you think? I think it looks delicious. Well, come on over and take a look. Oh my gosh, it looks amazing, Mom. Yum, yum, yum. All right, let's show them the candy corn recipe number two. All right, let's do it. So to make recipe number two, it's really simple, guys. All you're gonna need is a few candy corn themed ingredients to make your own trail mix. So let's get started. Okay, so we're gonna be making a candy corn themed sweet trail mix, okay? So this isn't as healthy um, as the first treat we did, but it's okay, it's Halloween. First things first, we are going to be adding candy corn, obviously. So we just add the candy corn in. You can put this in a Tupperware container, whatever you like. So we just have some candy corn down at the bottom. Then I'm going to be adding in some almonds. The almonds will help uh, give you some protein and have it a little, little healthier. Get some almonds in there. Mix all that up. So now we have our almonds and our candy corn. We're also going to be adding some of these jet puffed candy corn marshmallows. So we're gonna add a few of those. Mom, do those marshmallows actually taste like candy corn? Um, here, taste one. You're right, yeah, they're just normal. Yeah, they're just normal marshmallow guys. They just look like candy corn. So we're gonna put some of those in there. So there they are, and we're gonna shake it up. 
Okay, so the last thing we're gonna add, just to give it more of a Halloween color scheme, because right now we have a lot of the orange and yellow going, I'm going to add some black Twizzlers. Now, if you don't like Twizzlers, you could add jelly beans, you could add anything black colored, or if you don't like this, don't add it. Make sure you add whatever you are gonna be happy with and whatever you would like. I don't like black licorice, Mom. Well, you can pick them out. Or do you know what would, another really good thing would be to add to this to make it healthier? Would be raisins, because raisins aren't actually black. They're a dark, dark purple, but it would still give a great black color in there. Actually, I'm gonna go get some. All right, handful of raisins. All right, so let's mix that all up. All right, guys, and there you have your candy corn Halloween themed trail mix. So yeah, I think instead of putting the um, Twizzlers in there, the licorice, I think I would just put raisins because that would definitely make it healthier. So anyway, Lamy, you want to come try some? Yeah. Oh, Mom, it smells great. Yeah, it smells wonderful. Yeah, I agree with you, Mom. I don't think we should put the licorice in next time. I think we should just do raisins. Yeah, raisins tend to be more traditionally in trail mix anyway, so I think that makes a lot of sense. All right, guys, so yeah, those are our recipes. All right, guys, so there you have it. Hope you enjoyed this video. I have more Halloween videos coming, so be sure to subscribe. Also, follow me on all of my social media. The links are in the description box below. Also in the description box is a video that I made about how I want to start doing my live shows again. And I'm going to be using an app called Periscope. So be sure to look in the description box below to watch the video so you'll know how you'll be able to watch me do my live shows. I haven't done any yet, but they will be coming soon. So anyway, guys, let me know in a comment below if you like this recipe and if you're going to try it or if you've had it before. And I'll see you in the next video.